Hi, I'm Veena and today we are going to make another interesting, delicious, easy to make and tasty snack which is vegetable pancakes. You can have this as a meal, a snack or serve at parties. So to know what goes into making vegetable pancakes, keep watching. Let's look at the ingredients that will be required to make veg pancakes. For the batter, I'll be using two eggs, four tablespoons of maida, one cup of milk, salt and pepper to taste, and a little oil for frying. I need one cup of boiled green peas, one medium sized potato, boiled, peeled and cut into small pieces, medium sized onion, finely chopped, dry spices, half teaspoon amchur powder, half teaspoon mustard seeds, 1 teaspoon dhania or coriander powder, quarter teaspoon red chilli powder, 2 green chillies finely chopped, 1 inch piece ginger finely chopped, 8 to 10 curry leaves, half a teaspoon of jeera powder and a few coriander leaves finely chopped. I am now going to start making the filling and for that I am going to place the kadai. I am now going to add 2 tablespoons of oil into the kadai. Now that the oil is heated, I am going to add half a teaspoon of mustard seeds or rice. Now that the mustard has crackled, I am going to add the ginger, the green chilies, and the curry leaves. Now that all the spices are mixed and they've all got done well, I am going to add in the chopped onions. I am going to keep turning the onions around till they get translucent. I am now going to put in the boiled peas and now the boiled and chopped potatoes. I'm going to mix all this well before I add in the dry spices, which is one teaspoon of coriander or dhania powder, half a teaspoon of jeera powder, quarter teaspoon of red chili powder, half teaspoon of amchur powder, and salt to taste. I'm now going to mix all of this very well I will just add a few coriander leaves. I'm mixing all of this very well and now I'm going to cover the kadai with the lid and allow the mixture to cook on a very low flame for just a couple of minutes. While the vegetable mixture is getting cooked, I'm going to move to the other side and make the batter so that we finally have both ready simultaneously. We are now going to make the batter for the pancakes and for that I'm going to take this bowl and break the two eggs into it. Second egg. I'm now going to alternate between adding the maida and the milk into the eggs. And a little more milk. I'm now going to add salt and pepper to taste. I'm now going to give it a final whisk and our batter will be ready. And I just want to show that the consistency should be like this. So that it flows down easily when putting onto the frying pan. The pan is now hot so I'm going to pour in one ladle of the batter into it. So I'm going to put one spoon of the batter mixture into this. Spread it around. Allow it to cook for a minute and then turn it over. Let the other side cook as well. Both the sides are now done so I'm going to remove this onto a board and now I'm going to fill them up with the mixture that we made. I have put in one spoon of the filling mixture and now I am going to roll this up and get it ready and if there are any uneven edges you can cut them off. Our veg pancakes are now ready. If you like them please subscribe to India Food Network and I'd love to have your comments and feedback and go ahead and share these with your friends and family. We've got loads more for you. 
also subscribe to this channel and ping us at food at pingnetwork.in to tell us what you would like to see here.